Going back just 60 years, Britain enforced the death penalty by hanging for the capital crime of murder. And British Bathe was there to report on this contentious issue. Our present law provides that when a jury finds the accused guilty of Muslim murder, the judge must sentence him to capital punishment. In 1948, we were sure of our convictions. Yet just two decades later, hanging had been abolished. And 30 years after that, in 1994, Parliament voted on the issue once again. So it's clear that for both politicians and the public, this has long been a controversial issue. I was an MP here in 1994, when Parliament last rejected the return of the death penalty by a very wide margin. What does the public think today? I don't think it's just that um, the state should take away somebody's life. The film is about the death penalty, capital punishment. Definitely should be brought back. Why do you think that? Why do you well, think I think there's too many murders taking place now, and people are just fed up with it. Back in the 1950s, opinions were just as divided. Do you think hanging is a deterrent to murder? I'm certain it is. I'm against it because it's cowardly. I'm against it because it's inefficient, out of date, but above all I'm against it because I, I'm trying to be a Christian. It's my job to preach Christianity. I'm perfectly certain that capital punishment is incompatible with the Christian truth and the Christian way. Between 1950 and 1965, two cases in particular turned the tide in favor of the abolition of the death penalty. Then the detectives braved death on a nearby rooftop to bring Christopher Craig and Derek Bentley to justice after policeman Sidney Miles had been murdered. Craig fired the fatal shot, but Bentley hanged because he had called out the ambiguous four words, let him have it. Craig was 16 and so too young to be put to death. He served just 10 years. Bentley, illiterate with the mental age of an 11 year old, was 19 and so in the eyes of the law, an adult. He was sentenced to death as Craig's accomplice. This seemingly unjust verdict touched a raw nerve with the public and two years later, another case caught their attention. On June the 21st, Ruth Ellis was found guilty of murder at the Old Bailey and sentenced to death in accordance with the law. Ellis was a victim of domestic abuse, which led to the tragic miscarriage of her unborn child. In retaliation, she shot and killed her boyfriend, David Blakely. When asked in court if she intended to kill Blakely, she replied simply, it was obvious that when I shot him, I intended to kill him. The law at the time dictated that premeditated murder was a capital offence. No leniency was allowed. Ruth Ellis was the last woman to hang in Britain. Tony Benn was a member of Parliament at the time. I remember the day she was executed very clearly. I was involved and uh, the night before I think I went to see the Home Secretary or tried to see the Home Secretary to appeal for a reprieve and uh, it was a pretty it was a pretty grim case. And hanging a woman somehow seems worse than hanging a man, though actually there's no difference between the two. And it also did create some public anxiety, which had not always been present at the decision to execute. What were the events that led to the suspension of the death penalty? Well, I think that every Home Secretary who had the responsibility for granting a reprieve or not ended up as an abolitionist. The responsibility for having a life in your own hands is too much for anyone. Every few years the issue comes up again. Do you think the death penalty will ever return? For the supreme crime, the supreme punishment should be reserved. I think it's brutal and I doubt whether it will come back. I think it is now an established part of our tradition that you do not hang people. Pathé in its day reported both sides of the argument the case for the death penalty, and the cases of unsafe convictions that led eventually to its abolition. 46 years on, can hanging be said truly to have been consigned to the archives? Who knows? <laughs>